morning guys it is what day is it like how, how am i starting this i don't even know the day it's tuesday and i'm going skiing again um it is 5 30 i just got ready have my layers all on i'm packing this fabletics bag that i have um with water and snacks for like the road and then i'll bring my breakfast which i'm gonna make toast with cream cheese and see what else I can find to throw in the bag. But I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I'm like whispering, but it's obviously early and everyone's sleeping. But I'm so tired. I barely slept last night. I couldn't fall asleep for some reason. I was tired. But I'll sleep in the car, hopefully. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy today's vlog. And gonna be cool today there it's gonna be like 32 so last time was not that bad but i'll see you guys in the car just parked but we're just a little early and they're like grooming the snow and stuff over there all right guys i'm gonna start getting ready it kind of sucks because just like the last time i was tired but i started like sleeping more once like we were closer and same thing happened i slept a little longer though on the way here than i did last time but like you know when like, you're tired and you keep like dozing off and waking up and like you just get more and more tired so that's what just happened to me but it's time to get ready um i see people like going now but what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna actually put my hair in a braid before i put on my like face mask it's like 24 degrees here um today it's cold really really cold it snowed yesterday and it's supposed to snow again tonight apparently but we'll be done here probably by like three something four also these are like the suspenders that go along with the pants so i'm just like really hot in the car with my hair in a braid because last time my hair got super super knotty when i just left it out in a ponytail so i'm gonna put it in a braid so that it's like all together and then i'll be good to go I'm officially ready. I have my helmet with my goggles and my two gloves. And I'm good to go. See you guys when we're up there. I just put them on. They're so annoying to get on. But I did it faster today and I loosen them a lot. This is just like the annoying part. We're taking a break to go get some food for lunch and just like rest because my, f my like leg is hurting. Um, since the boot is so tiny, but it's having a lot of fun. like helmet hair it's super flat and weird but i left it in the braid and leaving the place now it was so 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 much fun 
and I definitely got better and also I did fall a couple of times really really hard like I fell on my like side this my right side I fell on my leg really hard and my like legs started hurting but other than that it was really fun and it's gonna be a long ride home it is 401 right now and I want to stop at Starbucks because I have so much money like gift cards on my Starbucks app so it's not really like I'm spending money on coffee for a long time because I have that and plus I love making my espresso at home like you guys know but when I get home it'll be too late for that so like on the way when we pass the Starbucks I want to stop and get something because I haven't had coffee today and I really want one and also to just warm me up because it's freezing today it's like 20 something and on top of that there's apparently supposed to be like a winter squall the same thing that was like in my TJ Maxx haul my TJ Maxx video there was a like a snow squall which means like for about an hour short-lived snowstorm with like a lot of winds it makes like this like being able to see really hard and the visibility is just really terrible everything just looks white and it's gonna get dark so if that happens while we're like on the road it's gonna be really dangerous so hopefully it holds off but yeah a lot of little updates but I will catch up with you guys in a little bit I'm going to just lay back and relax Today I got the salted caramel mocha. This is also one of my favorites since they don't have any of the holiday drinks anymore. And now it's the back to the regular cups. Shower time and it is literally fogging up already because I have the water steaming, which I need to turn off, like turn it down because I hate when it's too hot. I just made myself my green tea. I'm going to relax, catch up on some YouTube, and sleep early because I've been up since 5 a.m. <laughs> and I'm going to continue this vlog into tomorrow. Also, in the car, I've had, like, a lot of, um, like, sniffles, and I was sneezing a lot, so I hope I'm not getting sick. So I'm going to have tea again tomorrow as well. I just love having tea at night, but also hopefully it'll just help whatever could be coming. So, hey guys, it is now the next day and I actually wanted to include a sit down portion of this video today um, because I was thinking about it last night and like I just vlogged me going skiing and all of that stuff and I love doing activities and I feel like in these months a lot of people don't really know what to do if they're you know on winter break or just sitting at home and they're just like have no plans because you know it's winter time people always think you know these months are a little bit lonely or slow and boring because it's cold af outside which is true like obviously not every day you're gonna like have plans especially if you don't want to go out to eat and stuff and spend money all the time on things but i feel like once in a while there's so much you can do throughout any season around any um any month of the year you can do so much but you have to be open-minded and that's kind of like what i learned as i you know i'm growing up and stuff and in high school sometimes i would be bored during these months because i'm just like oh i'm stuck at home i have nothing to do but you have to like be open and obviously at a young age it's going to be hard to do these things so that's why i'm like figuring these stuff out now but there are kids our age um who just rather be at home but i feel like you guys need to like try new things and just be open because there's so much you can do in the winter time you know i go skiing and all that stuff you can do snow tubing snowboarding you just have to be open to trying new things and you will find a new hobby that you like without even realizing it you will find something else that interests you rather than just being home on your phone because that's literally what our generation has come to which is sad but i can definitely say like I love doing adventurous things and it makes me just want to do more in the future and work and save up to doing above and beyond so I just want to say like you guys should just go out and challenge yourself and save up for an activity that you've always wanted to try or even if you are scared to try it you can always there's always like a beginner level like when I was scared to go skiing I was like skiing I was like oh I'm never gonna be able to do that or snowboarding like yeah it was hard but at least I could say I tried it and even if even though I didn't like snowboarding I still did it and I still learned you know I don't like this but I tried skiing and on the other hand I love it and I'm already excited for you know next 
winter to do it more and more and just in my future so I don't know I just really wanted to talk about that because I feel like you don't have to wait till the spring or the summer when it cut like becomes nice out to do things like you can do things whenever you want you can do indoor water parks in the winter like there's so many things and so many hobbies out there that you don't even know you have because you're too afraid to try it and you're just closing yourself off especially during these months because you're just like lazy but I don't know you just have to like challenge yourself and just go after it because I don't know same thing goes with like YouTube like this I never million years thought I would be doing this right now and you know growing my channel and loving it as much as I do but I do enjoy it and if you are scared to start a YouTube channel and you've always wanted to start one start one whether that's on your phone or if you have a camera or not just start and if you're really passionate about it then you will do it um so that's like an interest that I didn't know I had and now I do it and I love it so much um like I said I do the skiing and there's certain things in the summer that I just did last summer for the first time like going to um cliff jumping going water rafting like I don't know I'm just opening myself up more and I can officially say like it really helps and it really makes me um feel adventurous and feel like I can do so much more and it makes me add things to my list of things that I want to do like a bucket list I guess in a way um whether it's small things or big crazy things that you want to do just kind of go after it and try it because you will never know so that's what I wanted to just end today's video off with I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and turn on that bell that is right next to the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any one of my other videos and also leave down below some fun activities or after watching this leave down below something you want to try and that you're going to you know work towards it because obviously not everyone can afford things there's things that i can't afford to like go and do but you know i will put that on my list and save up for it you know one day you know so leave some leave down below something that you will accomplish or you want to accomplish after watching this video right here and i don't know just go and try anything and let me know if you do and how you enjoy it so i will see you guys all in my next video